While some manufacturers decided to stay away from the 2018 Auto Expo, this year's Expo still promises to be exciting. TVS just had a big launch with the Apache RR310 and is most likely to back it up by launching the much-awaited and revamped RTR160 and the RTR180. Both these bikes will take on design cues from the Apache 200 and will come with an updated engine and most likely will have single-channel ABS as standard. The next big launch expected from TVS at the Expo is the production version of the graphite scooter concept that they had shown at the Auto Expo 2014. This is expected to be a feature-loaded 125cc scooter. A lot is expected from Honda at the Auto Expo 2018. Honda is most likely to announce the replacement of the CBR250R with the much-awaited CBR300R. The newly announced naked CB300R is also a possibility. There are also rumors of a possible fared version of the CB Hornet 160R that could also be launched. This year could also mark the entry of Honda into the small capacity cruiser market with the Rebel 300. Apart from these, Honda is also expected to showcase multiple models from its international lineup to gauge response from the Indian market. Yamaha will use the Expo to launch the much awaited version 3 of the R15 in India. This will be joined by the 2018 version of the R3 with ABS as standard. Another motorcycle that could make it to the Yamaha stall is the MT-03. There is also talk of Yamaha bringing in two new scooters to India, one being the Noza Grande and the other being the Aerox 155. One company that has been silent the past few years is Hero Motor Corp. This year will hopefully be different. While the Xtreme 200 launch is expected before the Expo itself, we expect the company to showcase the production version of the 300cc XF 3 art concept at the Expo. This could be joined by a fully fed version as well. The X-Pulse concept will also make an appearance but mostly still in a concept form. Apart from bringing in the new and updated Swiss scooter already unveiled globally to the Expo, there are strong rumours that suggest Suzuki is planning a single-cylinder 250cc motorcycle for India. We hope that Suzuki does that instead of bringing in the overpriced and underpowered GSX 250R and the V-Strom 250. Things are still unclear as to what is causing the delay of the BMW G310R launch in India, but the Auto Expo 2018 surely seems to be the venue for more information. But as of now, it certainly looks like the G310R and the G310GS will be launched at the Expo for India. Other motorcycles expected from BMW are the F750GS and the F850GS, both of which are expected via the CKD route. Prepare yourself to be blown away by India's first all-electric superbike from M-Flux at this year's Expo. This new machine will come with a 200km range, a top speed of 200km per hour and most importantly a 0-100 acceleration time of just 3 seconds. Kawasaki for the first time will be participating at the Auto Expo this year and are expected to showcase a lot of their international machines. Also expected is the India launch of the Ninja 400. Apart from this list, we are also expecting a few surprises on the Expo Day. So, stay subscribed to our channel for the latest from the Auto Expo 2018 as it happens.